Hey guys, welcome to Safi Mixed. In this video, I will explain the procedure for adding insert figure to a main figure using origin. The insert figures, such as shown over here, either explain some critical behavior of the plotting quantity by zooming up the behavior of the quantity in the in the critical region of the plotting parameter, such as this one in this region or it may add some additional information of the form shown over here to the insert figure so let us understand how can we add insert figures to a main figure to this end I have imported the data for plotting the figure and have adjusted the figure like this one and I want to zoom up the value of quantity gx in the vicinity of chi equal to 1 because this is some critical area where the behavior is not well obvious. And if you don't have the idea how to make the correction and adjustment like I have done in this figure, kindly watch my previous three videos where I have explained how to change the size of the numbers along the axis and how to change the colors or size of the plot and how to add the rest of the text so first i minimize this main figure and select reselect the data in the table and plot this one more time in a separate window like i have done over here then i change the value along x axis by double clicking it and and take this from 0 0.8 to 1.2 and change this from 0.5 to 0.2 then apply it okay that's good now this value is very well zoomed up i delete apply okay delete this because it's not not needed I change the size by first converting to increment and line and then choosing this to four the color one is black this one is black and then the second one the red and I take this one to four and then apply this and then choose it again in the frame by clicking the grid line and adding these text now it is framed so I click somewhere in this region okay I should I better remove this since it is against the same plotting so I delete this label and remove this one by clicking delete and one thing more I would like to change this scale increment from 0.2 to 0.1 so that it looks a little nice yeah it is now looking a little nicer and if I click somewhere inside the frame and then click ctrl C on my keyboard to select it and then minimize the figure then come to the main figure and I paste this over here then I select this and bring this somewhere over here and choose it and drag from one corner to adjust it over here I can adjust further by changing the size to any desirable size but with doing that we see that the without the curves and the I can increase the labeling by selecting it and then coming to this point and taking this 36 or I can further increase this to 40 or so that they are well visible and the same I do with the number along y-axis I come to 48 now it is 
will I come back to this point and click somewhere inside the and move this a little so that the numbers are inside the the same I can do with the curves by clicking on any one of them and choosing the width from 4 to 5 or I can add another number like 7 and uh, the same I can do with this one and I take this number to 7 and then apply and the width of the lines has increased. So this way you can increase an inset figure. You can further zoom it up by clicking on this and then come to scale and from 0.8 I change this to 0.9 and from 1.2 I change this to 1.1 and if I apply this I'll get further zoom in the value of quantity over here. So now we see that the behavior is more prominent and easily readable from here. On the other hand if you want to add some additional information to this figure and add another insert figure, you first need to add a new workbook which I am doing over here and then add another DAT file. I add this one, then I select this, I again plot this and uh, I do the same procedure like I did before then I adjust this figure by clicking over here and uh, I add the grid lines so that the frame is complete both to vertical and horizontal axis I also change the scale scale is almost this right so I don't need to change that it is okay and I just apply this and uh, one thing more I click on the curve and want to add symbols and that I can do from this position I add symbols I click over here on the symbol tab and I come to here I can choose any symbol by using this drop down menu and I want to choose one of the stars and I like this one I can change the color of the star from here by coming to this and I choose the red star and I can change the size from here and I want to go to 24 and then I apply it and I have this curve similarly I can change the size of the curve as well the size of the line that connected the symbols and that I can do by coming to this I can change the size from 3 to 5 or whatever you want and I can change the color from here by coming to I would like to choose blue or green the green is good let me add the green so I'm done with this figure now again and let me first delete this from here and then I I also want to delete this one and selecting it and then pressing the delete button and then I click inside the frame and then again pressing the control C button on my keyboard to select the whole figure then I come over here I zoom this up and I paste it by pressing control V over here again I select this and drag it to fix this somewhere in the void region I drag from one of the corners and I fix this over here this is now another figure now I can play the same way like before I select this and change this from 18 to 48 similarly long vertical I can change the size of the numbers coming over here and if I want to now I think I don't need to change the size of the symbols anymore in the curve because they are well visible. So this way you can add insert figures to a man figure.